Bless up Rastaman Delinja. Masha, what you say? Just coming off a flight. Heading to Costa Rica tomorrow. Yeah. Brooklyn next week, Amsterdam next week. I have a whole lot of work at home. We want to talk quickly about it. Two way artists, them. I know we have all the reasoning, you understand me, I said? Yeah. The two reasons I did want to do, you know, because I have. No, another reason, but I'm going to look for a reason for you next time. I'm going to talk about it. Um, I want to talk about Merciless and Queen Africa. We are still here. Excuse me. So, 30 seconds we are um, kick off the ship. What wow, the linja? So you think turn up? Big up yourself, man. All right. The first and foremost, I want to say condolences to merciless family. See, because you were going now. At the end of the day, you know, you know, man, a family, and no matter what family, I go still love you. Family, I got mourn for you, and family, I got miss you, and all them things. And friends, family, and friends. No matter where the circumstances, you understand me? I say, people, I got miss you. So, I've had a chance to work in Merciless. Yeah, and I mean, I tell you, say, I wanna, I wanna, the, wanna the real you them. I wanna real you them when. In a lot of part of my life. Me and him never really get along still. And yeah. But in a hurry, when we just knew him, when we just get to meet him, like, trust me, was a real brother. I remember, I remember him as the first man who actually picked me up down a moonlight drive and took me to, um, took me to Champ, took me um, to Tivoli Garden. Tivoli Garden did have them yearly show. And he was the first one who actually took me to Tivoli Garden. He, now, being the man was the first man who really called me up on stage to sing Nike. But we have Nike here and Heads Eye and them tune to start going. You know, Merciless is the to drive come pick me up and carry me down at Tivoli. And, you know, from them time, I'm going look back. So, again, me and him meet up in a place named St. Vincent. The St. Vincent people them can relate to this. And my first time to St. Vincent, I tell us I'm flopping you know? up. The way I flop, man, I tell you, I flop, wicked man, because, yo, he come like, I don't know what happened people, but I say, yo, I go up on the stage and I have no voice. Voice gone, because, you know, so when you're just a boss, if you don't know if you use your voice, you know, if, uh, if, you, if you meet up on a microphone with tough, and you sing in the microphone and you, um, your voice now cut through, like, with the, with the, with the, with the, with the EQ and them thing there, you know, say, yo, that can hit back your vocals them, so I may say or make it strenuous for your vocals them. So yo me reach a St. Vincent and I tell you I perform yo I flop like dog and, and merciless save me you know yeah man merciless save me I come so boom and come on and the man mash up the place oh, wicked yo St. Vincent people must remember that show them the man mash up the place oh, wicked and then call me on Zin. And I run on and Sucky Ducky was like the biggest tune down there. Sucky Ducky was the number one tune. And I run on back with him and he called me back. Because I'm sister, I'm flapping up. And he called me back on the stage to redeem myself. So it's a real youth. It's a real youth. Otherwise, I'm not me and him do quite. Me, as, as a matter of fact, I'm me and him used to live on the road more than any other artist, you know. 
So when me did just a bus now, you know, it's like, to me, I didn't go to St. Vincent and certain place that the promoter them would feel, you know, like it was a good package to book me and him. So me and him went up at some place, I think me and him went up at St. Cry and him, you know, a sister down there, love him half. Yeah, man, so there's a whole of stories about Merciless. It's, it's, it's actually a sad loss. Merciless is a sad loss. So, me and him don't really get along. Well, well not really me and him, because I never see it as me and him have nothing still, but in a lot of our time life, I don't really like, challenge him, you know? I scold him, you know? You know, in a Q45 yard, I see him one day in a Q45 yard, and I scold him, I scold him wickedly. And him never like how I deal with him, so. Because you know, so he's a straight up youth, he's a straight up person, I'm going to tell you. I'm not going to wait until you're dead and come a ball for you. I'm going to tell you when you're alive. Me that. I'm going to tell you to your face, too. I'm not going to go around your back, go speak. I'm going to tell you to your face. So, I see other things when I know, so maybe detrimental to your health and detrimental to, your, to, to yours. To your survival, me I go tell you. Me I go tell you. So me and him never really get along in the last part because he bought me out to me tell him certain things. You understand? But what me I say is, me find it strange. Say we, we wait until we brother them, you know, reach a certain point and deteriorate to a certain point. Then we then, then we come out a ball and we come out a more. We try, we try to talk to we brother them and we sister them and we see them. When we see them, I go through things because remember, say, people have mental challenges and people have psychological challenges and people have substance abuse um, challenges and people have alcoholic challenges. Alcohol, you know, alcoholism is, is, is very rampant in our, in our, in our um, society. It's, and our artists, them drink all the Hennessy raw. You know, a man the other day when I uh, uh, must see peace and belly them take out, you know. And me see a little youth like a Jashi, them when they go up on the stage. They must have a, a buckle in them hand with the alcohol. And them don't know say alcohol is poison. Alcohol is poison. So when you reach all 40, 50 or them age, you know, them things they start to take a toll on your kidney and your other organs. Then. So when I see the youth, they do them things, they challenge them. I say, yo, when you be careful of them things they want to put in on the body, you know, because when I go reach a certain age, and first thing it's going to make you look cool. You see? It's going to make you look cool. It's going to mash up on the vocal cord. When I sing past stage, you no, know, I sound better than when me just boss. Because I take care of my voice. And I exercise it by even coming and talking to you. Know. Me exercise it and I learn how to project it and everything. So I keep it, me keep it working. I exercise my, my vocal. I say, I sing, I sing, I music, I do. I entertain, so I always attack. But I not strain my voice. I learn how to project my voice. So I not strain. And that build up the vocal cord muscle. You understand what I say? Well, later on, we're not going to get into where really, cause you understand me, I say the family are more female and everything. So, we're not going to get into where they did a drink or where they did a do. We just make you know, so we, 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 we can do a better job of talking, challenging with brother them and with sisters, and we see them go through certain things. I will see them act a certain way. You see, I say, don't just turn a blind eye and watch them deteriorate, and then we come bad, and then we come more, and then we come put up, miss you, our condolences, our RIP, our gone too soon, and them something there. Challenge your brother and your sisters them with them alive, brethren. Tell them, say, yo, what you do? You know, you have to check yourself. Try to find help for them. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? Try to find help for them. You know what I'm saying? Hold them accountable. Say, yo, I do this here, you're my brother. I challenge you. You see? I get your help. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, that is that. Now, Sister Africa. I almost crashed the internet. Sister Africa almost crashed the internet, you know. Yeah. Because then put out her image or her image come out or she put out her image where it looked like she trim her hair. And she had some sexy thing a wine up. And of course the, the, the male hierarchy the male hierarchy get frightened. Are them, them them smell blood? That in frighten like the, the, the male hierarchy in our society, especially in our dance hall world. Them smell blood, so them run at them, all of them now. See, like she trim her hair now, and of course them run out. 
them run out and ready for school or ready for beat or ready for session or real, ready for say a long time she this, ready for say a long time she that, you know why? All the talk with Africa talk over the years, them never with her, you know. All the talk with she talk over the years, all the fight she fight, and a champion for, for, for the kids, them, and a champion for the, 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 the little youth, them. Against predators. Them never want to hear that, you know. This just proof to you, say, yo, them never in her. Because she just come now and put up that on the internet and look how the whole of them run out. You know how long them in the shadows? You know how long them in the shadows want this happen? This happen? Or, 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 or wait for a moment when they can tear, tear into our skin? Notice the male hierarchy. You know? you, who you think the, the control the male hierarchy? The male hierarchy? Or who you think they, they are the male hierarchy? People like two locks, them and them man, they will be always tell us that a, a, a sexism them deal with. Them man the sexist, they don't care sexist no more in my opinion, you know. So the male hierarchy run out. And they're ready to, to, to eat up our flesh because they must say, right now a time now for she get a beat. Now long time they want to beat her, you know. It's long time they want to tear her to pieces. But let's say it, if, if, if it were true that she cut her hair and she bleach out her skin and she a wind up. Why is it that we have to run out? Why the man them have to run out and ready for chastise her? Ready for condemn her? Ready for burn fire upon her and all them something? What if she were going through some form of challenges? Because more time people do some things, you know, people crying out for help when they do some things more time, you know. People sometimes try to escape a situation, you know. Sometimes people in a situation and they try to escape the situation you know, and they say, you know what? You say, I take that turn yeah? me I go last the person. You say, I go that way yeah? me I go last the person then. Sometimes some people, some people in your life more time, you know, you do whatever it takes to shake them people out of your life too, you know. So some of the time when you see some people come forward and them do some things and them take some drastic measures, sometimes they go through some things and they want to escape something or they want to deal with something or they want to cry out for help. It, it's all different manner of things, you know. So why is it that the first thing, the male hierarchy, have to jump up now and feel like, say, when a person come out now, if I cut you cut off her hair, if, if she bleach out her skin or whatever, I say she did do. Why do you think, say, the first thing to do attack her? Why the first thing can be, sister, what go on with you? you um, me see you, me see you um, cut off your ear. You all right? Why the first thing when I have to do a grab on a phone to come slice off our flesh, or slice off people's flesh? When you don't see a little thing, when you don't see a little something, when you don't see a little action, when you don't see somebody a behave, or somebody behave a change, why you can't say, yo, maybe that person is good at go through abuse, maybe that person is good at go through stress. Maybe that person is good at go through a loss of a child. Maybe that person is good at go through all the things, you know. Maybe that person is good at suffer from all, um, um, you know, some form of traumatic something will happen to them life. And it just come forward. And some people, sometimes, you know, them looking at the mirror and they might try to hurt, even when they see in the mirror, you know. And I try to change up them looks and I try to change up them features because you don't know where a person is. And everything people come about come telling me, you know. I remember that some things happen to some people like where they can't share with Uno Dutty Drunker, you know. Because if they share it with Uno Dutty Drunker, Uno go say, yo, them guilty. Uno go say, yo, them are dark shit, them are this, them are that, them are whatever. And we are not about people who just come and make up a lie and tell lie to get attention. We are talking about people out there who have genuine, you know, have story with genuine where they can't share. So they battled up and them more time and just do some 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 things. For, for cope with it's like it's copism, you know. We don't think about them something there. Remember saying you know, we know see I I think have a pattern of doing stuff where we can't say, oh she always do that. So if you see the sister come out this time and she cut off her ear, let's say that were the case because she come back and she show them say she have her locks, she not cut her ear. She have to come come justify say she not cut her ear and prove to them say she not cut her ear. So so the whole of them. And them are gonna come now for say, 
They might go find another way to justify, you know, to extend the weight why they did about her out, you know. Even though she come now and say, yo. You know, they might go find a way to still tear into her flesh. They now go apologize, you know. And say, sister, here we go on a two year talk. We should have to reach out to you. We should have to link you and check if you are right. Because here we go on, we could have to wake up and hear so you commit suicide. We could have to wake up and hear so you hurt yourself. We could have to wake up and hear so you're on drugs. We could have to wake up and hear so you know, you, you see me, Master Virgin? So they might go find a way, same way to justify what they're doing, you know, because here we go on now. Remember, they might feed sheep, you know. And from they start feed sheep, you know, the sheep, them, when we tell them about the, about, about, about the, um, the classical conditioning. It's a classical conditioning, you know, them know, so the dog, them hungry, you know. So every time, you know, so that, that, that's something there, you know. Like them, I ring the bell now, the dog, them want food, so they, they hear the bell, I ring, the bell, I ring, and the dog want food. So anything, then grab. Then just comes a woman and grab it and just And just dash it out so, so let's say This was the case where If this were the case where she cut off her ear and, and, and a wind up and A bleach out or whatever you say she had See in? Oh no no sir, I know just something she had got you. Because when you could have reason with this so, so K sunshine say false rasta. No no you false rasta. It's either you're a rasta, you're not a rasta, when you're false rasta, when you're false rasta. But let's check it out you know, the whole way have something false about we you know. When you check it out, if you're gonna call a person false rasta because them start with them wind up themselves. Or because a person cut them here. That means that here we go on now. You already been living with the physical. And you already been dealing with the physical. So in other words then. You are telling me. Let me, me, me address this before me. I, I hope me not forget what me dad say. In other words you know. What you are saying now. When you say false rasta you know. And this is an argument about false rasta. That means if Gina Africa did have alopecia. And she had to cut her hair. That means that you know, more reverence she being a rasta fairy. Than, 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 than even try to let herself look attractive in a way where she knows that she's an artist and she has to present herself to the public. So what if her locks them a drop out and she say, you know what, Jano, this not working, you know, because the ball spot in my hair. I mean, like when my husband and I say the ball spot in my head and the two locks drop out from the bed and one locks drop out the ground and I sweep up and find two locks around here. So, see? Two locks, no pun intended. See? You don't know where a person got through your combo falls, Rasta. <laughs> you see what I say? You don't know if a person, a fix a person could have to fix up. Remember saying, you know, you are not the one we are laid down and wake up with that person, you know. And that person is a human being, a human being of emotions and human beings of a, of, 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 you know, you know, a thing called, you know, confidence and them all of them things where they want boost. Everybody have a little ego, you know. Everybody have a little, need a little confidence booster, you know. And everybody can't just have some people can't well I know everybody because you see people come on the internet and when you look them at the dirty teeth them not them out and they still come on. So you see people come on them they them not you not even know them name, you know. You just know them as two dirty teeth, one dirty over here, so one dirty over here, so and them not them out wide and talk all day. And then continue making videos with the dirty teeth them. So you know so them not even address it when you point it out. So some people don't really care about appearance. You see me as it? Some people don't care about appearance. So you just when you see them, you have to just say the dirty teeth girl, come on. See? Yeah. But yeah, some people will care about them appearance. So you don't know if a woman wake up and want to look good for her husband or her, her lover, her boyfriend, or whatever. You don't know. You're gonna jump up because a person cut her ear or a person cut him ear and say, Fast Rasta, this, that, 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 that. Some people, some people, you know, just want to look attractive to them to them lover. Are them husband or them wife? You understand me? I say some people just want to look good and feel good. You see? But but the problem is we don't put everything on the physical. We don't put everything on the physical, you know. So that means that do we only live on the physical, you know? Do we only put and 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 attach everything to the physical? See? We are the one where discriminate a person will lose them hand or lose them foot or lose them eye. I get burned up with acid. I meet in an accident and cripple. Who are the one that discriminate against those type of people, you know? Because here we go on, who no deal with inner self, you know? Who no deal with the physical. At the end of the day, people, 
You is not just the physical alone you have on a real near. You have your soul for deal with. You have your, you have your, you have your sanity for deal with. You have your feelings, your emotions, and all of them things that you have to deal with. You know. Every day when you get up, you deal with the physical. So you see, the more emphasis you put on the physical, big up yourself, but the more emphasis you put on the physical, it's simple telling you, say, you know, let me come on the internet and me not look like how you know, want me looking you know. up. Because remember, the, you know, the reason why you don't call a person fast rest you know, is because the, you don't want the person look like how you don't want the person look. So I say, in other words, listen to me. Because she's a rasta who stand up for certain principles like stop molesting the youth, them stop turning the youth, them not gay. Because enough man they are Jamaica pick up a little boy, them for true. So when I say if she weren't at a rasta, when I wouldn't listen.